Action potentials originate in the sinoatrial node and travel across the wall of the atrium from the sinoatrial node to the atrioventricular node. Action potentials pass slowly through the atrioventricular node to give the atria time to contract. They then pass rapidly along the atrioventricular bundle, which extends from the atrioventricular node through the fibrous skeleton into the interventricular septum. The atrioventricular bundle divides into right and left bundle branches, and action potentials descend rapidly to the apex of each ventricle along the bundle branches. Action potentials are carried by the Purkinje fibers from the bundle branches to the ventricular walls. The rapid conduction from the atrioventricular bundle to the ends of the Purkinje fibers allows the ventricular muscle cells to contract in unison, providing a strong contraction.